guys, it's Lucy from ILOC and welcome to All Things Events, where you learn all the tips and tricks on how to be in an events industry. Welcome to another video and this video is all about decorating. I am going to show you how you can achieve a 5 star hotel or restaurant setup using your kitchen utensils. First things first, I have glasses. I have three sets of glasses. I'm going to explain to you what type of glasses I have in front of me, even though some of you guys can basically know them just by looking at them. So first things first, I've got my water glass. I'm gonna use this as my water glass. It is actually a wine glass without the actual stand, but I'm gonna use it as my water glass. A second thing, I have my um, champagne glass. Some people call it flute. Some people call it champopalopo, whatever you wanna call it. I have that. And then I've got the last glass, which I'm going to use it for my white wine or my red wine. So these are the three sets of glasses that you will need. You can also check in your kitchen your water glass your champagne glass and your wine glass it doesn't matter if it's white or red we'll just use one for now second thing i have my cutlery i have three forks so these are my three forks that i'm using i will show you why i'm using three forks and then i have one spoon which i think you know it by now it's for dessert because i love chocolate and then I have two knives. I'll show you why. And the third thing I have is my bowl. And another thing I have is my plate. I've got a just a normal round plate. It's not fancy. And last thing that I have with me is my napkin. Basically a piece of cloth that I'm going to use for my setup. Now, I'm going to show you how you can achieve all of this within 10 minutes. So first things first, you want to make sure your table is nicely cleaned and all your center pieces, your flowers are right on the center and ready for you to start setting up your table. We're going to first use our plate. You make sure you center your plate and then make sure it's nicely put on the center. And the second thing that we're going to put there is your bowl. The next thing that we're going to put is our cutlery. Now, because we are having uh, a three course meal, I'm going to set up a cutlery like this. So your starter fork is obviously on the outside and then your main fork is on the inside, but these forks, they look the same. So you don't have to stress about that. Next thing that we're going to place is your knives. So make sure with your knife, the sharp side of the knife, you must make sure it faces the plate. That is the correct way of setting up your dinner table. And then for your starter knife, you just place it right next to your main knife and then slightly put it a bit higher. And another cutlery that we're going to place is our dessert spoon. Your dessert spoon is usually facing the forks. Actually, it needs to be right at the top, depending on what dessert that you are having. So I will just place two, rather hold it like that. Okay, that looks nice and clean. Now, another thing that we need to place are our glasses. Now, you guys know I have three sets of glasses. I've got my white wine slash red wine. I've got my champagne glass and I also have my water glass. Now, how are we going to place these glasses are on the right hand side. We first place the water glass right in the middle of the knives and then we place the champagne glass right on top on the inside and then with the white wine or our red wine glass you slightly put it on the top here as well make sure it's just next to the champagne glass so here's our setup lastly what we need to put is our napkin so i've got a napkin here i want to show you guys how you can place your napkin. Usually, I like a nice napkin just placed like this. Just let's just move this there. This is how I normally like my napkin placed. We can even fold it there and then we put it right on top here. But for 
Today, I want to do the croissant design. So we're going to change our napkin and make it look like a croissant. So what you have to do, make a knot on your napkin. Don't make it too tight, just make it enough for it to have some room to breathe. It's placed right on top of my plate and then I'm doing the croissant design. It's not too tight and then you flip it over and you adjust it so that you don't show the wrong side of the fabric. And the fabric is obviously your napkin. And then we're going to place our napkin just next to the, to the bowl. Now it's nicely, obviously I kind of like curved it because I want you to see how you can basically place it. And this is how you can have your dinner set up. You can do it at your comfort of your home using your home utensils. Everybody at home has different types of glasses with uh, your champagne, your white wine, your water, and also you have cutlery. You guys can see with the cutlery that I'm using, I'm using the same forks, but what I did when I was placing them, I just sort of adjusted them. Same thing with the knives and same thing with my dessert spoon and another fork. And basically this is how you can do your setup. I hope you guys do enjoy it. I hope you're going to try this. And when you do try it, please, please, please don't forget to tag me on Facebook or on Instagram with the name that's written down below. It is Sipesi Lelosi and let's share some more decoration videos. And yes, that is it for today. Please do not forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel. I will see you on my next upload. Mm.